Parker and his traitorous hirelings plan to blow up an important railroad bridge. But Batman and Robin discover the plot and zoom into action. <laughs> Stone. Drown. The same way that Batman and that kid will be in a minute. Let's take the good news to Ducker. No, no, I'm afraid to face him. Remember, we were sent out here to wreck that train and bring back his radium gun. We got rid of our biggest obstacle, didn't we? He makes a squawk, I'll tell him where to head in. Come on. You all right? Sure. Did they get away? Yes, but we saved that train. Well, that's great. I wish we could have caught one and made them talk. Found out who they were working for. We'll make it our business to find out. Come on. <laughs> Hello, my little pets. Come on, Nojo, Nojo. Here, Sacco, Sacco. <laughs> Want your breakfast, huh? All right. Mmm, good. <laughs> Eat them all up now. Yeah, good. Oh, good. Don't you bite him. <laughs> yeah, one for you. Ah. Ooh, last one. <laughs> good, huh? All gone. Got no more. Uh-huh. Still hungry? I got no more, but... You want something special, huh? Go on, leave the room. Sit down, gentlemen. Mr. Forster should arrive at any moment with good news for all of us. He will give us a detailed report on the destruction of the supply train and very likely will have recovered our radium gun. Gentlemen, let us celebrate our triumph, huh? Good idea. Well, Where? Bring sake and glasses for six. This is the celebrated King Forest, my friend. The greatest exhibition on this street, in this town or any other town. For the small sum of only ten cents. Come on in here and spend a dime, my friends, and wise yourself up. It's not a circus. It's not a carnival. This is a serious proposition. Something that everybody in this world... Continued success of the new order. The new order. That is Mr. Foster now.
Well, Mr. Foster, we were just preparing to celebrate in anticipation of your good news. Tell me, was the train wrecked? How many were killed? Many? Well, it was stone. Stone? Oh, but about the train, were all the cars wrecked? The bridge didn't blow up. But that is impossible. I myself prepared the charge. Besides, you had our secret weapon in case the bomb failed. Or did you not recover the radium gun? No. The Batman still has it. But I think we finished him off. You think? I will not tolerate this inefficiency if you cannot carry out your assignment. I will get someone else to place you. That's okay with me. I'm fed up with your Jap new order anyhow. Maybe the rest of these stooges lead up that applesauce, but I know different. I don't need any handwriting on the wall to tell me who's going to come out on top in this war. Because it's written as plain and black as death in every newspaper. That's what I came back to tell you, because I'm not afraid of you. You've shot your bolt, Dacca. You and all your Axis cronies. You're through. Are we? I'm quoting from the winning side, Dacca. And believe me, that's right where I'm going to be. But you do not believe it is so simple as all that. Now, do you? The League of the New Order of Hirohito, heavenly rule and prince of the rising sun, marches on and nothing will ever stop it. You might just as well try to stop the tides and the winds. Wells, Wild, come in here. Seize him! Stop him or I'll shoot! Sit down, Preston. Now, are you going to open that door and let me out? Or would you like a quick visit to your ancestors? But of course you can go. And that's the kind of answer that fits the color of your skin. Open the door. So long, suckers. The sooner you get wise to yourselves, the better for you. You've got your chance now if you want to take it. Oh, come now, gentlemen. Surely your curiosity must be satisfied. Perhaps Mr. Forster will serve as an object lesson to any of you who may entertain similar ideas. Section 1. Section 50 reporting. Proceed. The Gotham City Foundation expects a new shipment of radium today. Any further details? Yes. It's arriving on the southbound Mail Express to here at 4.15 this afternoon. Linda Page has the papers authorizing her to receive the shipment. Very good. This radium is very vital to us, gentlemen. And we must secure it before we do anything else. It's four o'clock. I hope Linda's having no trouble with the radium shipment. Why should she? She's got half a dozen armed guards with her. Besides, what makes you so sure the gang will try and hijack it? I just told you, this gun uses radium. Listen, Bruce, I just received a mysterious phone call about Uncle Martin. I'm to go to some fortune teller's place right away, and he'll tell me where I can find him. Oh, they warned me not to call the police if I ever wanted to see him again. I still have enough time to go there before meeting the train, and I wondered if you and Dick would come with me. Well, Dick and I were just leaving for the polo matches, and I promised to take him, and, well, I, I hate to disappoint him. But where is this, uh, this fortune teller's place? 720 Front Street. Linda, you've got no right going to such an awful neighborhood. Oh, forget it, Bruce. I'm sorry I called you. I'll take care of it myself. Uh, but, Linda, darling, this is the break we've been looking for, but we'll have to hurry if you want to get there before she does. Enter the temple of faith, Miss Page. Swami Dhar will see you in here.
What do you wish, gentlemen? Uh, we want to have our fortunes told. I'm sorry you did not make an appointment with me. What's the difference? You've got nothing better to do right now. I'm expecting a client here any moment. I must ask you to leave. When are going to go till you've given us a reading? I told you to get out. Look at this. Oh, I was afraid of something like that. Earphones and mic. Well, give me a hand with it, quick. Section one. Linda Page left her office about 20 minutes ago to keep her date with the Swami. She should arrive there shortly. Good, go to your appointed stations and wait for her. Yes? Get rid of any customers you have. Linda Page will be there any moment. I am ready. Very good. That was a strange voice. Now, Linda will be here right away. Go outside and tell Alfred to keep out of sight until Linda comes out again, then follow her. You hang around, I might need you. Check. Enter the temple of fate. Swami Da will see you in here. Yes? I was told to come here to receive some information about my uncle, Martin Warren. Uh, please be seated. You are in grave danger, Miss Page. Who are you? Never mind that. Leave here at once and return to your home. Go. Police station. This is the Batman. Tell Captain Arnold there's a little package waiting for him behind the couch at 720 Front Street. It's securely wrapped and tied, but may spoil if kept off the ice too long. Why did you follow Linda when she came out? She hadn't come out yet. We never took our eyes off that fortune teller's establishment, sir. Then we'd better search that place. Bruce, look, in here. Linda. Oh, they've knocked her out. They stole a delivery order for the radium. Must be on their way now to pick it up. Take Miss Page back to the hospital in a taxi as soon as she feels a little better. Tell her, well, make up some story. Yes, sir. Look, an armored car is just leaving. We'll try and head it off. Uh, good hunting, sir. These papers we took from that page, Dan, will make it a sense for us to get the radium. Stick get in the back and change. I'll drive. Turn on 19th Street to avoid traffic. There's a car trying to catch up to us. Well, I'll tell Hank to step on. Step on it, Hank. I think there's a car following us. I told 
knew we'd hit him off. It's the Batman, but he can't get to us in here. Well, let him have it. Close in, get alongside. What for? You can't break into that thing. I can blast my way in if there's any kick left in this radium gun. is communicating with a Jap submarine. What deviltry does he plan? Who do Daka and his hirelings have in the coffin? And must Robin carry on the struggle alone? Don't fail to see The Living Corpse, Chapter 5 of Batman at this theater.